welcome back to my channel. It's me, your girl, Lens Call Love, hitting you up with another video. And okay. today's video. Today's video, we'll where we'll be doing a this look. This look. Um, it's pretty much a recreation, so we're recreating with a little flair. Cause I'm cuter than the girl that wore it. <laughs> For you to let it go, let it go, let it go. Ain't none of your business, ain't none of your to know who I'm with. Oh, none of my shit. Ain't none of your. All right, guys, so welcome back to my channel. It's me, Lanska, here, and I'm back. With a video with my friend here, Nicola. Say hi to the channel. Hey, guys. If you had watched my Jamaican tag video, you would have seen her with that video. Like, I like what, two years ago? Is it two, two years ago? ago? It was a long Bye, time ago. Like, two years ago Bye, or a year ago. So today we're doing this a bit, right? Look at this. Look, people look, can't talk. So we're going come out on all these things. I'm so ratchet. <laughs> what? What was that? You rush out? Guys, so I'm gonna just go ahead and recreate the same thing over to the right eye. So if you love these kind of videos, be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, share with a friend. You know, make them arrow the good and you know, you know the shrimps, you know the shrimps, you understand? You understand? All right, guys. So I'm just taking some concealer here, and I'm gonna just use that to outline her bro while also basting her eyelids just to prepare it for the eyeshadows right the concealer will allow the eyeshadow to come up more on camera and to show better right so i'm just using a flat brush to apply the concealer then i'm moving on to this neutral palette here and i'm taking that dark brown shade and that will be my transition color for the crease now guys i'm using a fluffy brush to apply this all over the crease area and also i'm um, taking my time to ensure that the color actually shows up on her lid you know when you have um or chocolate complexion you have to ensure you have something there to kind of like show the colors especially colors like you know browns and so on so that's all i'm doing guys once i'm through with that i'm gonna now move on to a darker brown shade and taking a more um dense brush i'm using that into the crease section as my um, transition as well but I'm just using that to just darken the crease so when I cut it it will be very very pronounced right so guys you want to just ensure to keep going back and forth ensuring that you know the colors are blending cut together correctly you want to you know create a sense of diffusion among the two colors making sure that you blow the colors out so it doesn't look too harsh so just to intensify the crease color I'm taking a dark that um, black shade there and I'm just taking a little like a small amount and just feathering out the color um you know on the crease section there just to, like I said int intensify that dark shade so when I cut the crease it will be very pronounced and obvious right so guys I have done many videos showing you guys how to do a cut crease so I think that you guys should be able to know what to do you know because it's been a lot of videos a lot as if you're actually watching the videos but anyway <laughs> I'm taking the concealer again using the same flat top brush and I'm taking my time to create that cut crease here guys I always tell you guys when you're doing a cut crease you want to ensure you take your time and be very precise with your hand movements you want to make a half circle like a half circle over the lid so you want to take your time like I said taking your time is very very imperative you don't want to rush it if you rush it it's not going to come out properly so you have to be careful all right now I'm moving on to applying the lid colors I'm taking a dark brown color first and I'm applying that to the outer corner of the lid as you can see here I'm using a small flat brush and I'm just you know dabbing the color onto the outer corner of the eyes once I'm through with that, I'm going to move on to use a nude, it's almost like a peachy nude color into the, the middle section there of the lid, right? And I'm just patting it using the same motion like I did with the brown shade, so nothing special. Basically repeating the same thing. Then guys, I'm going to use a lighter shade, it's almost an off-white, off-pink kind of color, and I'm using that at the inner corner where the wrist of the concealer is, alright? So yeah, very simple. Then I went over that shade with a pink shimmer color. And that's like a nude pink shimmer color as well, just to intensify and to brighten that area. Now it's on to do 
my wing guys this took me so much time but you know I can't make the video run for too long so I had to speed it up but you want to have a steady hand guys and be careful when you're making your um your wing line all right so as you can see I'm just taking my time there and I made the line going upward first and then I dragged it down into the inner corner right once i threw that i went ahead and used uh the, i think this is a navy royal blue kind of color and i used that to set the liquid um liner because i didn't want it to run so i'm just putting that um blue shade on top of the liquid liner just to intensify the color and guys you want to take a small flat brush to just dab it into the color to apply it to the wing there and i'm just intensifying it by just rubbing the color just so you know make the color show up on camera and be more vibrant and more you know because we're adding we're gonna add glitter to it you know so i'm using this blue glitter first this is a liquid glitter liner and i'm using this color first just to give that um that wing there some dimension so we have two different shades of blue on it right so i'm just applying it there and then you will later see me go ahead and apply some more glitters but i'm gonna be using a darker blue shade and that blue shade is more the more towards the color of the actual liquid liner right once i've done that guys so you see me showing you showing you guys the, sh the glitters now so that's the glitter i used it's a similar color to what we used to actually create the wings now after we apply that to the eyes then this is where the excitement will come in because we're gonna be using some chunky glitters and these glitters are not blue they're actually silver and because of the way they um were created they give a uh, iridescent kind of vibe you see you see clear you see it shows out an array of colors once the light hits hits it so it looks very very beautiful guys i hope you guys um are taking notes on this it's a really really very very nice look and very easy to recreate as well guys so all you need to do is just be patient and take your time no need to rush it like i always say whenever you're doing these technical looks guys you want to ensure that you you know use some patience you don't want to rush it because if you do that it's not going to come out the way you want it and it's not going to look good right so take your time and it might take you a couple tries to get it perfectly but you know invest that time to learn how to do the thing you know so when you go out you can you know look nice and you know yeah it's a new year enough you want to learn how to do the makeup thing you have to really invest time and effort and patience you understand so yeah moving on from this guys you will see me apply her lashes and these lashes are 25 ml lashes which is why they're so long and these are the wispy ones so they are interlock with each other creating like a wispy um look yeah and as you can see she's showing out for the camera very <laughs> she's showing out for the camera and then I went over to the next eye and I added some more details to it because one side was having too much so I didn't, I didn't want it to look uneven so I just added some more to just you know balance it out so yeah guys easy 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 like it was an easy look to create um yeah so just enjoy the rest of the video guys and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already leave your thoughts down below in the comments section be sure to turn on the notification bell so whenever i post a video you never miss an upload don't forget guys please we're almost at 300 subscribers and i'm on the road to 1000 so help your girl share the video with your friend them and make them know how to beat them face too don't be selfish don't hide this knowledge you know share with your friend them leave a comment leave a like please i'm asking you guys please okay share on all social media platforms follow me on instagram at lance love and follow her at queen nikki on instagram as well all right guys so i used two different foundations on her i used la girl and i used um juvia's place on her and i created this um shade because i didn't have her perfect match so i just used those two colors i'll leave the names of each color down below in, in the description box if you guys are interested in that all right and i used um the juvia's place concealer to also do her highlight and i used the fenty beauty matchstick um in espresso to do her contour so i'll leave um the information down below in the description box if you guys want to check out these foundations and all of that uh yeah guys so enjoy the rest of the video and thank you again for watching and please do not forget to subscribe and share your thoughts with down below in the comments section
Alright guys, so I didn't have a blue, um, a dark blue lipstick to apply to her lips So I just used the liquid liner that we used to create the wing on her eyes And yeah, I used the exact glitters I used on the eyes on her lips except for the um, silver one And basically this is how we came up with the blue lips with the glitter And it's really really simple like I said guys So nothing for you guys to worry about So if you want to recreate this look definitely go ahead and give it a try and tag me on instagram like i said my instagram name is at lansko love and yeah let me know your thoughts guys don't forget to leave your thoughts down below in the description well in the comments section and share this video with your friends make your friend them come out make them rush out like how queen mickey rush out you understand yeah don't be don't be selfish do not be selfish share with your friend them and make them come out nice and clean so yeah don't be share, don't be afraid to share the video guys Share it, like it, comment, all of them good somebody. Thank you for watching. So thank you guys for watching and remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Bye guys. <laughs>